Everyone was just kind of like, what are you doing? She's the one who took a year off of med school to go and sing on a cruise ship. My name is Sapna Parikh, and I'm a doctor, I am a journalist, I'm an artist, I'm a science communicator, and I am an explorer. I started in medicine, went to medical school, I moved to New York City and was doing general surgery, level one trauma center in Queens and all the drama. Incredibly hard life. When I was in med school, I remember hearing a reporter talking about the flu vaccine, and I thought, if she just said one thing, like why the protein mutates, that's why you have to keep getting the flu shot every year, that could have helped a lot of people understand. And so I wondered if I could do something in journalism using my expertise and my love of communication in a different way, and was able to become a reporter in New York City. No word yet on when or if this vaccine will be fully approved in the U.S. As a journalist, I had to start over to learn that skill set, because I was starting in the number one market in the country where people are expected to hit the ground running. I was covering topics on public health, on medicine, physiology, studies, breaking news. When it comes to HIV and AIDS, one of the best methods of prevention is, of course, education. Over the years of doing that, I fell in love with the storytelling aspect. And when I left ABC, I went all in creative photography. I'd always wanted to do that. Video, study the technical aspects of cameras. I worked as a full doctor and reporter. You know, I'm in the, like an intern in the gear room. Recent years, I've been doing both sides of the camera where I identify these cool and compelling stories happening at these organizations and am able to bring them to life visually through photography, through video, through hosting stories. I get to learn so much in the process. The discovery of a two million year old fossil has researchers at NYU and around the world excited. I really feel like I followed my own heart through my own career. And there have been really scary transitions along the way. Three, two, one, go. And so it's just taken these twists and turns that I never would have imagined.